Yeah, 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 I get that, Utah Raptor. I didn't understand what your question was, though. Does it happen? What are you talking about? Yes, if any map you play, you're gonna get money. It's easy to use. Once you get good with it, you can do one to two bullet kills. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I was going for that kill. 87, dude. Damn. I should fight. I didn't know that there were like custom maps like this. We get money. Yeah, dude. Fucking this. What? Believe it or not, uh, this doesn't crash as much either. When I do this with you guys. Oh my god, that was nuts. This is fun though. It, it is, it is. Halo, just with the more reduced gravity. Yeah. Oh yeah. Did I have a lot of maps like this, guys? We could definitely get down. Mario maps too, man. I went on a Mario downloading spree one day. <laughs> I love when you guys play, man, and being live on Twitch is so much funner and like having you guys, my community, playing these maps with me, man. Appreciate you guys being involved always, dude. It's awesome. I feel pretty proud of myself. I, uh, my buddy Biz, Biz SNES, I don't know if you guys have heard of him. He's a Super Nintendo puppet, like for his face on camera, and uh, he has the still after everyone died though, he had the uh, the writer of the Console Wars on his uh, the book, the Console Wars, the war between Sega and Nintendo. Back in the day, he had his him on the uh, stream earlier, and um, he let me ask him two questions, and one question was. Will he ever write a book about the Microsoft Sony war? And he's like, possibly. He's like, if uh, he has enough resources to do it, you know? I was like, hell yeah. And then I asked, uh, what was the other question? Oh, how he feels about PC gaming. And he's like, he thinks it's an innovative market and he thinks it's like one of the best consoles. I was like, nice, I like those answers. I told uh, Biz, I was like, thank you, man, for, you know, doing that. He did, he aced it. He aced the interview. Like, it was dope. He's getting all kinds of opportunities because he's about to get partnered, you know, contract offers, all kinds of shit. So he's got like the big dogs on his stream. I tried the no scope for the last yeah. kill, but you had to do it. <laughs> Give me a sec, guys. I'll change it back to Scouts and Knives. One second. It fucking auto changes if you don't change the map before before the game ends. I want to make the rounds longer, but I don't remember how to fucking do it. I think it's MP round limit. I want to say. You guys know in the chat. No, no, no. This map auto changed, guys. It auto changed because I didn't change the map. I want to change the round limit because they change so fast. Yeah, 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 it auto changes if I don't change the map before the game ends. Sorry about that. I'm changing it back right now, just give me a minute. I'm 
changing the map, so hold on. playing this map, it's just it auto-changed uh, username, it auto-changed, so if I don't change it in time, it's what it does, it goes back to the first map that began the, the rotation, basically, uh, sorry about that, I forgot to, that's why I'm going to change the round limit, I'm going to see if I can make it longer, like 30 rounds instead of 15, or 50 rounds even, just so we can enjoy the map a little longer. MP round time? Uh, no, that'd be round time. I need round limit. Round time wouldn't be it. No, that's not it. Let me get rid of the body box. I think it's... Let me see. I'm going to find it right now. Round time is how many minutes the round is. No, that's... No, dude. That's not it. I just said, it's that's how long the round time is. Three minutes. There's MP round time hostage, round time diffuse, round time and round restart delay. Round limit is just a three minute thing, dude. It's that three minute round. It doesn't, that doesn't, low. It doesn't do anything. Round uh, limit is just the three minutes per round. That doesn't change how many rounds you play. I think it has to be on competitive mode. That's fine, I'll just keep changing it when the game ends before the thing does. Time to earn our stories. How come the gravity's not low this time? I have to set it every game. Hold on. guys just remind me to change the map like right when it ends okay I'm just gonna toggle arrow up on the console so it doesn't fucking crash and change it to the original start map all right just remind me if I forget because I get into the game sometimes I don't fucking remember and shit be like hey Imperial change the map change the map just like quickly remind me as soon as it says game over because I literally have five seconds to change the map after it says game over, literally. Unless you guys can like try to figure out or Google it for me real quick because I can't access my browser. What the fuck, how to change the rounds, the number of rounds, not the, not how long the round is, the number of rounds to like 30 because it's 15 on casual. I want to change it to 30. Nice, man. Damn, 87 on you. I want to play this map a couple of times. I love this shit. Push, push, push. Woo, champ! That two bullet massacre. Feeling it, folks. Oh my god, that was beautiful. Oh, I was gonna die. Oh. Oh. Let's do this and get back in time for child. Oh. 
Woo! What was uh what was your damage, champ? Oh shit, 17 health left? Oh my god. My fucking gun like like okay, I'm not gonna kill you, but I'm gonna bite the shit out of your health. Oh, one bullet. One bullet, dude. I told you, you could do the one bullet kills with this gun. Wow, 85 that time. Damn! I didn't know if you knew where I was. Dude, great game, guys. This is so fun. We'll do this again after this game. I don't mind doing this map a few times. This map is so godlike. Let me know if you guys have any requests of maps you want to play, too, and maps you guys want to see in the Twitch chat. Um, I have a lot of fucking maps. I don't have nearly as many as I do used to on Source, but I have a lot. I have a lot I haven't even tried yet. We'll do that Halloween one too, dude. Yeah, that one was so much fun. Yeah, we'll do that one for sure, guys. Right. It's definitely on my mind right now. Good shit. That one bullet, bro, I told you, man. Fucking, this gun, if you know how to use it, I've seen people destroy op users with this gun, believe it or not. Nice. Because it's faster. It's a faster fucking shot. Oh yeah, dude. The rock, you got this. I challenged somebody to get to the top of those blocks, man. You can do it, too. Me and Champ fucked around and actually got almost up there. Champ got all the way up there. I almost got all the way up there. It's one of the best sniper spots too, if you can stealthily get there. A little secret about the map. Push, push, push. That descending kill I did on what's-his-name that night with the one bullet, I was coming straight down on his head from one of those blocks and BLAM! I was like, that was like the kill of the night. Everybody's going fucking crazy in here, dude. Real secret, guys. Um, one thing I learned playing this game like thousands of times, this map, don't jump if they see you. Because the gravity will get you killed. Never jump when they, you only jump like when they don't see you. That's the secret to this map that no one knows. Well, some people know, some don't. Yeah, but you don't want to ever jump when someone sees you. You can get the kill floating in midair, but like it's the the shot is um, delayed and it's crooked when you're floating down. So you have to. It's like the grenade map, you know, the, the with the gravity on that we always play the dodgeball. Same with that. It, it also changes your shot the same way you throw your grenade when gravity's off. So you have to adjust it. This is just like smarter. You you get killed when you jump in this map. <laughs> 